Hey everyone, I'm here revisiting my old Miiverse posts from 2015, 2016, and 2017. And most of these were from the Wii U, and I really enjoyed Miiverse when it was around. It was, it was very fun, and, and I, lot, I made a lot of friends too. So, let's start with 2015. And my first post was Donkey Kong Country. I finished the game in 1 hour and 35 minutes and the game is actually, well it's pretty easy for me man. Yeah, it was my first post and felt accomplished getting 101%. Next, I finished Donkey Kong Country 3. I got 105% and it's well it's actually difficult to get that score especially because you know there's no checkpoints it's yeah it's tough but I managed to pull it off and here um, this is F0 yeah um, I don't I don't know what they're called those um, the yellow machines but they get in the way and then yeah they keep you from from progressing especially on on higher difficulties Here I was, yeah, I was very proud of this moment when Ryu was announced for Super Smash Bros. Wii U and 3DS. He's one of my favorite video game characters. And when I saw the trailer, I was, yeah, I was happy. I was very thrilled. It was a, it was a dream come true. Here I complete a classic mode with Ryu for the first time. So I really liked the picture and I just shared it and the congratulations, it's different from other characters too. Oh, this is one of those um, one of those screenshots from, from the challenges, the pictures. And I just thought it was funny so I, I just shared it. <laughs> These were my um, my Mii Fighters originally. I I gave them each um, a different name, but then I just call them um, Enigma. What I what I call myself. It's not my real name. It's just the name that I gave my my me. And this is Kirby Nightmare in Dreamland. And yeah, I honestly I do prefer. Um, Nightmare in Dreamland over Kirby's Adventure, the NES version. It's um, well, yeah, the Game Boy Advance one. It's the graphics have been updated, but I really do, yeah, I like it over um, the Kirby's Adventure. Yeah, that's one of my favorite Kirby transformations. It uh, it returns in the Amazing Mirror, um, but I don't know if it. If it's around, if it came back in the other game after that, honestly. But I haven't, I haven't played every Kirby game, so I might be wrong. Maybe it has returned, or maybe not. Let me know in the comments. And this is from Meta Nightmare. You play as Meta Knight, but it's um, it's funny because you you play as Meta Knight. And you fight Meta Knight even though <laughs> you're playing as him. So I just thought it'd be kind of funny to post this screenshot. And this is from the uh, Great Cave Offensive in Kirby Superstar. I managed to collect all the treasures, so I just celebrated with with this um, with the screenshot. Here I was just making a comparison to. Um, I was just comparing the Critter and the Nazi to the Koopas and Goombas for from the Mario games. But in this case they're I guess the equivalent in Donkey Kong Country. Here yeah, I was sharing my uh, favorite tracks from Donkey Kong Country 2. Uh, Jib Jib, Crook Smarge, In the Snowbound Land, Forest Interlude and Sticker Bush Symphony. I used to pronounce it sticker brush, but it's it's actually sticker bush. 
and well here I finished all the uh, events but um, yeah I finished the events but I have no idea why I posted that it was too soon to you know to retire this was my uh, first attempt at a drawing and I I tried to draw um, Captain Falcon's machine, the uh, the Blue Falcon, I believe that's what it's called. My first drawing is just, well I'm not a good artist, but I, I tried. Here there were two um, inklings, they were just peeking on the window, but it's, <laughs> it's funny because you could just walk in and there was no reason for them to just do what they're doing, <laughs> so I just posted that. And I can't remember the name of the level, but I was comparing it to the lightning, lightning lookout. I forgot the name, but yeah, this is one hard level, but it's not as you know as difficult as the lightning level because yeah, that level I rage, I've lost too many lives too. And yeah, it's just frustrating for me. This is from, uh, I forgot, it's not Rainmaker, it's, uh, I forgot what it was called. But when you write it, it's, you only play it on ranked matches and private battles, but, like I said, when you write it, it makes this little jingle sound, it sounds like a, like an ice cream truck. Here I attempted to draw a cold man from Mega Man and Base. Uh, which is actually one of the hardest Mega Man games out there. Uh, here, once again, I was... Uh, it's one of those yellow machines, but... It's... Well... They, they're the same model as the yellow ones, but this is one of the exploding ones. I just captured it from... From the front and just... Just I'm um, saying that they look funny from the front because, you know, I'm more used to seeing them from... From the back when when you pass by them and now let's move on to 2016 run Rambi run this is when you're being chased by King Zing on the level before you battle him so I just shared this and here I drew a, a sad face um, because the uh, the servers were down in Splatoon and well, we all know this is mostly an online game, so it's pretty much no fun without it. <laughs> and here, this was a, uh, a Splatfest event. I the theme was Pokemon. It was red and blue, and I chose the uh, the blue team, so that's why I <laughs> I wrote that. <laughs> um, no idea why I wrote that but there doesn't appear to be anything smelling nearby oh here I uh, I chose Duck Hunt and I put the CPUs as Duck Hunt as well so I just took this funny screenshot and just <laughs> and just wrote that song uh, well I'm, I'm not a Little Mac player but this was one of those screenshots in the game the, from the challenges, so I just thought it'd be funny to post that. And next, I I bought 3D World uh, that day. Uh, I got it three years after it was released. It's yeah, it's a still it's still a fun game, but Champions Road, yeah, no, that was a pain. That's the it's the hardest level in the game. And this is one of the uh, levels in 3D World. This was a Splatfest event. It was the SpongeBob theme. It was Team SpongeBob and Team Patrick. I chose the uh, the SpongeBob team, but uh, in this post, I was just making a a reference to. Yeah, to the episode Bubble Stand when he's trying to teach Squidward the technique to for blowing bubbles. But yeah, <laughs> I don't, I don't think I won that Splatfest. 
Yeah, I don't, I don't know. I might have. Um, well, most people remember me for this post because... But it's, you know, it's kind of funny because I, I, I didn't drew this. It was actually my brother who, who drew it. It was actually his idea. But then, yeah, this ended up becoming my, my main post and when people remember me from Meavers, they, they remember this little drawing that was made, even though I didn't make it. Um, here, yeah, I was right. I did not win that Splatfest. Yeah, I didn't. Uh, I was, I took that screenshot believing I was gonna win, but the Patrick team were the ones who ended up winning. Uh, <laughs> just a random pose singing, it, it takes two. <laughs> yeah, it's just a, yeah, just a random pose. Here it's that um, one song, uh, well most people will remember it from from Cars, but actually the one in the movie, in the movie Cars, it's actually a cover, it's not the, it's not the original song. The original was made by um, Tom, I forgot his last name, but yeah, the one in the, the one in Cars, it's a cover, it's not it's not the original song. Um, here I was responding to this player. I was um, comparing my inkling to Pyro from Team Fortress 2, Cabal from Mortal Kombat, and the killer from My Bloody Valentine. It's a, uh, a horror movie, in case you haven't heard of it. <laughs> this. Yeah, I was <laughs> I was trying to be funny and well, I guess you can say this is cringe, but <laughs> I don't know if it rhymes or not. Y you be the judge. <laughs> And here I was just, well, <laughs> I heard that, I heard that squids are edible, but I don't know what they taste like, so I just, <laughs> just posted that wondering if the Inklings, you know, have, take the time off or do anything on weekends. <laughs> and it's just a, a random post with Bowser and Wario. Um, I have no idea. I don't know. I don't know why I posted that. Um, well, this is when you you stomp on his head and turns. He turns and he makes a weird noise. I don't know if he laughs or I don't know exactly what he does, but it just makes a weird noise. Uh, here once again, I was. <laughs> Trying to be funny, but guess I'm not. Uh, this isn't, I uh, forgot what that mode was called. It's when you, it's when you fight all the bosses, but yeah, I ended up winning, so I, I posted that. Now, this is the, uh, uh, the, the name of the level, and yeah, it's one of those, um, I don't know what they're called, but yeah, it's one of those levels where, but basically in the level you just, um, there's that power up you use, the, the one where you inflate and you float. It's actually pretty easy once you know what you're doing. All you, all you have to do is just keep collecting the power up, the one that makes you float, and just avoid the, uh, the little balls that the charging chucks throw at you. It's, yeah, it's not that difficult. Here, um, well, Ice Cave Chant, that's the name of the song. It's my second favorite song in Donkey Kong Country. My first favorite, my favorite one in the first game is the Aquatic Ambience, the uh, water level. Boing! <laughs> Just the uh, random post. Um, I believe this was a, uh, yeah, a Transformers reference. 
Uh, I, I do like Transformers. I'm, I'm a fan. And this is a, uh, a He-Man reference. Not a f big fan, but <laughs> I just posted that. Here I uh, finished the... I was after a match and you get the breaking news message when when they're gonna um, change the uh, the maps for the regular battles and ranked matches. So I just I don't know I just posted posted that random <laughs> random quote. <laughs> no, I, I I don't scream like a girl. I was just happy that I I ranked up to A. Yeah, I ranked up to A on my own and I was just happy at the moment. But no, I don't. <laughs> I don't really scream like that. Madoken. <laughs> I was um, out of coins, and yeah, I, was, I didn't have enough coins, <laughs> and I just posted that one song. Your price is way too high. You need to cut it. <laughs> Oh, uh, th yeah, this is one of my favorite final smashes. In Ultimate, they added um, Base and Proto Man. Well, it's just a funny screenshot here. Samus fell off, and <laughs> I don't know what Villager's doing. And here I finished the, uh, the minecart level, the first one. But yeah, it is a fun level. <laughs> you didn't give me enough coins. I believe I wanted more coins. Oh, this was the uh, final Splatfest. I chose um, Team Marie and we ended up winning. But yeah, I got to be king one last time. It was, uh, yeah, before the whole Splatfest stuff closed down. <laughs> he gave me a super sea snail. Here I drew the uh, title screen for A Link to the Past. Oh, this is that moment in Nightmare in Dreamland when the nightmare appears from the Fountain of Dreams. I'm just King Diddy and Kirby <laughs> panicking. This is a uh, Ghostbusters reference. Uh, I like the movies, yeah, I'm a fan. Haven't seen the new one yet, the new movie, but I, I will someday. Now, this um, this is a uh, Mortal Kombat reference. This is what Johnny Cage, I mean, no, not Johnny Cage, this is what Sub-Zero tells Johnny Cage in one of his intros in Mortal Kombat X. And this is a... Yeah, it's actually very creative how how Elegman, his, that's his name, his weakness is the cutting ability. <laughs> yeah, it's just kind of creative how that's his weakness in the game. That was my birthday that day. I beat Dr. Wily for the first time. <laughs> Bowser was looking away. I got the Mega Man amiibo. Sometime after that, I, got, I bought the Ryu amiibo as well. I still have the, I still have the both amiibos today. Well, here I was checking my records, and I, I guess I assumed that the jump in White Land Two slowed me down. <laughs> I was playing, yeah, I was just playing, and then just grabbed Bowser and. <laughs> just took the screenshot. <laughs> Once again, trying to be funny. Oh, here I collected all the stars in that the, in the bonus game in Super Mario World. Stay fresh. Oh, here I finished um Super Mario World. I believe that's the highest score. I might be wrong. It's a star, star 96. 
Well, they say that's the highest score. I I might be wrong. I don't know. Oh, here again, I finished Donkey Kong Country. But however, this time it appears that I set a new record. And I finished all three files too. Oh, here, Donkey Kong Country 2. Finished all three files and I set a record on one of them. Three hours and 15 minutes. 102%. Yeah, I'm actually a, a WWE fan, and yeah, I drew the uh, old the old logo from the Attitude Era. In, in case you're familiar with it, but yeah, I'm a wrestling fan. I, I like I like WWE. Oh, this is a uh, um, Sin and Punishment. It's an N64 game that it wasn't brought to America at first, but they localized it um, on virtual console on the Wii first first on the Wii and then on the Wii U all right now let's move on to 2017 um, here I completed all three files in Donkey Kong Country 3 and I set a record five hours and 34 minutes No, actually, I don't. I don't wish. Never mind. I meant to say, um, um, my cats, not not one cat. Yeah, I made a mistake there. Yeah, I really could never tell how to get a hundred percent in the link to the past. But I completed all three files. I got all hearts. But uh, yeah, I could never tell how to get a hundred percent. Completed all three files in Kirby Superstar. Here, um, I completed Nightmare in Dreamland again, all three files. Um, it's a random post. You can't see the the rest. Uh, yeah, I can't show you, but it followed something. Forgot what I was referencing. Uh, can't remember. Yeah, once again, here I can't show you everything. Yeah. But I was sharing more things that I finished in the game. Oh, here it is, what I what I've told you. Um, yeah, Champions Road, what a pain. I managed to finish it with all characters and Oh, it's yeah, it's one of the hardest levels and that's Something I, I never want to do it again. I'm never going to do it again. <laughs> nope. Mm, uh, I wasn't... I guess I wasn't too happy about the score I got. <laughs> well, technically they are made by the same person, you know, the Kirby series and Super Smash Brothers. But I just posted that. Yeah, you fight Master Hand and Crazy Hand in The Amazing Mirror. They're a boss. It's a boss fight. Well, you fight. You can fight Master Hand individually, but in here it was it was both of them. Well, we got well we got King K. Rool in Ultimate. We got Inkling and Isaac was an assist trophy, and Springman is also an assist trophy, but. We got Min Min as a playable character after that. And well, I thought Ridley was never going to be playable, so I was suggesting that they include a Space Pirate or Zibisian. I don't know if that's how you say it. But in the end, we, we got Ridley after all, so yeah. Yay. Uh, here I was asking for help, and I did complete the challenge, but yeah, as I said, I can't show you the rest. Here I complete all the trophy boxes. I believe I was watching something funny that day on YouTube. <laughs> uh, I guess he didn't give me what I wanted.
<laughs> well, I don't know what to say to that. <laughs> kind of looks like Marie's flipping them off. <laughs> Just a funny screenshot. Yeah, um, Poffles Minion. Yeah, he's a great YouTuber. He has great content. Uh, and here my inkling was taking a nap. Just thought it'd be funny to post that screenshot. Oh, here um the uh, I don't know what happened, but the uh, Waddle Do just changed into this, and and yeah, I just posted the screenshot. Yeah, it's one of those challenges again in Wii U in the Wii U version, and I just. Yeah, just um, it's just a full screen, and I just decided to share it. I really like it. And here I completed the amazing mirror. Oh, now this this was something I drew, and it came out. Yeah, it came out perfect. It's one of the uh, best drawings I've done. I don't remember how long it took, but it it came out really good. That's one of my best works I've done. Oh, I finished um, Sin and Punishment that day. And here I did the uh, Out of Bounds glitch in Splatoon. It's when you go outside of the wall, but if you uh, if you go too far, you fall, but you spawn, but then you spawn back to to where you start. In in uh, in uh, in I forgot what it's called Inkopolis I believe, but yeah, if you fall you just spawn there again. Oh, that was my uh, my one uh, hundredth post. Once again, I was asking for help, but I did complete it. But I can't show you. Oh, that was a difficult challenge. I remember that. Oh, another challenge. And I completed it. Wow, three in a row. Three challenges in a row. Oh. <laughs> um, I don't know. Well, there are there are a lot of people out there with crazy artwork and <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> no comment. Don't ask me. Hmm. Poor Kirby. Uh, this is a uh, a Chun Li reference. If well, if you play Street Fighter, you'll know what you'll get it. You'll know what it means. All right, completed another challenge. Oh yeah, um, here I I reached, um, I got S rank, and yeah, I was very proud of that moment. And But the thing is, I, I didn't do it alone. A friend helped me out. I couldn't have done it without him. So yeah, thanks once, ag thanks once again, friend. Here I was sharing the, well, all the stamps I collected in... In 3D world. Wow. <laughs> oh, here I was playing um, Earthbound for the first time. Yeah, it's a it's a great game. It really is. It was my first time playing it, and I loved it. Oh, here I finished Earthbound. Oh, once again the uh, out of bounds glitch. This time I went inside the uh, the cafe. Well, I thought that the uh, servers were gonna close first for the first platoon, so I just posted that, believing that it was gonna end. But it's still the servers are still going on today. I don't know what that is. I was asking for help again. Oh, here I completed all the challenges. 
Yeah, I use the hammers, but it's still better than nothing. <laughs> At least he's healthy, right? Oh, here I believe these were just random posts. I guess I was running out of ideas. And this is one of the in-game posts for Splatoon. Yeah, these were my last posts. No, oh, this was my last one. Thank you, friends and followers. You guys are awesome. I will miss you all when Meaver's closest. But yeah, I really do miss most of them. I miss Meaver's. Um, made a lot of friends, but ever since it closed, I never got to talk to most of them again. Some of them I, I follow on their own channels on YouTube. I have them on Discord. And some of them are subscribed to my channel as well. But yeah. Uh, and I, I'm friends with some of them on the Switch, but you know, you can't send messages there. No. But for its time, you know, Meavers was fun. It was a great experience. And well, thank you for watching. If you enjoy this video, leave a like comment and subscribe and i will see you guys next time thank you for watching